My name is Kyle and you're watching Let's Play Char Johnson on YouTube. Well, are you going to introduce him or are you going to sit there and look him out on the log? I thought you were going to do all that announcing. All right, introducing now his opponent, Tony Depp. Well, if that's the best you can do, I will introduce him. Andy Two Dandy's opponent will be Bad Attitude, Tony Depp. Well, if that's the best you can do, I'm going to go ahead and tell you the winner of the match. Look at Tell Tony Dabbs he's in envy over the way that Andy Two Dandy's cut off. Look at that muscular physique of Andy Two Dandy. Lock up, on an elbow, bad attitude, and a side headlock. Referee Joey Liam right on top of the action to make sure there's not a chokehold. Look at that. Look at that. An illegal fist to the beautiful face of Andy Two Dandy. And referee Joey Liam getting on the bad attitude of Andy. Just because, just because Tony Dabbs is about 45 pounds overweight and isn't muscular and cut and ripped like the great Andy Two Andy doesn't mean he has to mess up that, that face of his. Well, that might be an improvement. Uh, Collar and elbow lock up in the middle of the ring. Again, bad attitude into a side headlock. Chokehold involved there somewhere. But he's pulling out. There we go. There we go. He was pulling out in there, Mandy Two Dandy. Beautiful move, reversal by Andy Two Dandy. And a big move to the midsection. That attitude goes for a close line. A big shot to the crowd. Holy chop. Which was perfectly like it was open handed. I'll give you that much, but you know what? You know what else is perfectly legal? He's getting dressed. And looks at bad attitude and says, ow. Tony just like almost chopped the one hair off of Andy Two Dandy's chest there. Andy Two Dandy going for a close on bad attitude. Scott's right in the middle of the ring. Bows up on Andy Two Dandy and he slides out, looks at the referee. Where are you going, my way? Come on. Oh, oh, you want to, you, did you hear that? Tony Dabbs calling Andy Two Dandy a lightweight. Well, at least Andy Two Dandy doesn't have to go to the wrestling junkyard each and every Monday after a weekend of wrestling to find a new shoulder. The bad attitude was given Andy the benefit of the doubt. He called him a lightweight. He could have called him a featherweight because that'd be more like it. Bad attitude into an arm bar. Oh, oh, Referee asking Andy Two Dandy if he wants to give it up. Oh, look at that. No. Oh, he's out and stepping on a poor kid's hair. He's not on his hair. He is, too. He's, there we go. Look, he's stepping on his hair. Andy makes it to the bottom row. Oh, here's the hook. That should have been a disqualification right there. Why? He had to a five count. He broke it at three. Because Joey Lynn was counting slow. A big forearm to the shoulders of Andy Two Dandy, and a uh, member of the Pink Penny Posse not doing too well against Bad Attitude right now. A big kick to the back of the head, and Bad Attitude still on his head. Bad Attitude throwing those arms up in the air. What's really funny when that shoulder comes out of place? He throws both those arms up there, and he goes like this. A low blow from Andy Two Dandy. Bad attitude down on the mat. Low blow! Oh, I didn't see a low blow. What are you talking about? You're a freedom! I've never seen anything like that. I've seen a big boot to the chest from Andy Two Dandy. Down on the knee. A bad attitude. And a second time comes down on the knee. Takes that knee and lays it on top of the back of the leg of the attitude and pulls up on that. The referee asking bad attitude if he wants to go up. Bad attitude saying no. You know, not only, not only is bad attitude going to have a, an old man's shoulder after this match, he's going to have an old man's shoulder also. 
and I was kicked to the back of the back of the knee from Andy Two Dandy. Andy Two Dandy going in for a half Boston crowd. Again, he's got a boy. Look at that. Sport, sport man right there, Andy Two Dandy. That's why he's a member of the Pennsylvania Boston. Again, referee Joy Lynch has a bad attitude if he wants to give it up. Bad attitude saying no. And the fans here in XOW Wrestling get behind bad attitude. All the fans here, they want to get behind anybody. The only people they know why they get behind us are the people in the Memphis Pride each and every Friday afternoon. Andy Too Danny with a kick to the knee of bad attitude. And rock kick to the knee of bad attitude from Andy Too Dandy. And Andy telling the referees that he can't wrestle well, with Colin can't, Mack. Well, he can't even stand up, much less continue in the match. Well, you don't have to stand up to make a three count. Bad attitude with a double handful of hair of Andy Too Dandy. And he's still continuing to work on that leg and a two count. Again, referee Joey Lynn asking Bad Attitude if he wants to give it up. And Bad Attitude says no, Andy Too Dandy. And what is Joey Lynn? Joey Lynn's just got the pin. Joey Lynn almost had the pin on Tony Dabbs. Bad Attitude grabbing the arm of referee Joey Lynn because of the extra pressure from Andy using that, the that was a disqualification. You do not put your hands on an official. And, and again, Whoa. Bad Attitude grabbing referee Joey Lynn because of the extra pressure from Andy to Dandy on the bottom that. rope. Whoa, Joey Lynn did not take that from Bad Attitude. Andy coming down with an elbow to the knee. And Andy's saying he can't walk. The fans here in XOW Wrestling, I can hear a few of them. Every once in a while, saying, go, bad attitude, go. Bad attitude with a fist to the head of Andy Too Danny. Finally gets the whole broken. Andy back to his feet before the 10 count. Go, 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 go. Oh, 